We have some romaine lettuce along with our cucumber in our beautiful salad bowl. And we have some ground beef mixing up on top of our salad. It is pre-cooked and drained. Next, we have some tomatoes, delish. Some black beans, rinsed and drained. A low sodium option. You can use any beans you'd like. Pinto beans go really well with this recipe as well. We have some drained sliced black olives, yum. And we have some cheddar cheese. This is such a delicious, easy salad packed with flavor. All right, we're gonna give this a little bit of a toss here. It's okay if some things don't get quite incorporated. We're just kind of mixing it up slightly. Wow, I love all these colors. Mm -hmm. That red is so vibrant. Mm -hmm. You can totally chop your tomatoes up smaller if you'd like. I love the way they burst when I bite into them. Agreed. We're gonna go ahead and add some dressing here. We are using a French dressing. Catalina dressing also works great with this. It's gonna give it a little drizzle, just like that. We're gonna let that seep right down into those crevices, and we're gonna let this chill in the refrigerator for just a moment. Okay, so we had this in the refrigerator for about an hour or so, just so everything could get nice and chilled. We are bringing in some fresh cilantro. I love this addition. I always add this right before serving. So good. I'm gonna go ahead and scoop some of this into my bowl. Yum. I love the addition of the beef. Grilled chicken also would go very, very well with this recipe. So good. Look at all those great colors. All right, so this is a great salad, but you know what makes it better is Doritos. This is a Dorito salad. Now with the Dorito salad, you wanna make sure that you don't put the Doritos on until you're ready to serve. So once you're ready to serve, that's when you can take your Doritos and crumble them up. You can either put it on all of the salad or let your guests crumble them up themselves, just like that. Yum. Let's go ahead and give this a try, shall we? Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if you leave those chips in there, they get soggy, and we don't want that. So you wanna just add the chips right before serving. All right, you guys, so scrumptious. Here we go. Mm, I love the way it smells. Mm. All right, you guys, great flavors. You gotta try this salad.